I'm not enjoying being in the room with you playing. I don't understand who you are, okay? I realize now that I barely knew you before. It, it's been a beast, and it's sucked a lot of me into it. Some kind of monster. It is the best mirror we've ever had in our lives. It was honesty and truth. It was undeniable. It's just so weird because you guys were just supposed to film us making an album. And all of a sudden we we just set our instruments down and started talking. And next thing you know, we have a movie about a really dark time in Metallica. I was straight up with you. I think it's stock. Which part of that is unclear to you? What have you been doing? Picking at me all night. Save up the tension. Ah. Tension produces results. If I hadn't had music in my life, it's quite possible I could be in here or be dead. I'd much rather be alive. What is it you feel that you're not saying now? If you're not happy playing music with me, if you walk away from Metallica, I'm not sure that it would surprise me. I'm prepared for the worst. As a result of the alcohol, it was just very difficult for him to communicate from the heart. I wake up the next day somewhere in some bed. I don't know who this person is next to me, and I'm drunk, completely hung over, and have a show to do, and the result is the same. It was so predictable. The unraveling of a fan, and then there were two. I hope he will come back and try and finish the making of this record. It's going to sound amazing. The stadium with 100,000 people raising the evil horns up to the sky and saying, Metallica, baby. I'm afraid to get close to people because I don't know how to do it. I don't know how you're supposed to do it. I'm working really hard on being the best dad and husband I can be. And life now is pretty exciting. You don't know what's going to happen. I like that. Bow, bow, doo, doo, doo. Yeah.